as a father, when you get older, you want do you want sons? Like you want you want to be a father one day, a dad one day? Probably. Probably. Okay. You you have your you got a dad, of course. In your life. Do you, you do you like look at him like a role model, like he inspires you? Well, that's that's what you would want. That's what yeah. I got I understand it. Because in the black in the black community, there's a lot of absent fathers. Right. There's a reason for that. Watch this. Let's see what the Bible says. The book, of, Deuter the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 6 and verse 4. Listen up. Hear, O Israel, uh -huh. the Lord our God is one Lord. So the Bible says, hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. So there is no Buddha. There is no Krishna. There is none, no other Allah. All of that is not existent in the Bible. It's only one Lord. Read. And thou shalt love the Lord thy God uh -huh. with all thine heart. Right. And with all thy soul. I'm getting to the point. Just, just, just bear with me for a second. Come on. And with all thy might. Uh-huh. And these words which I command thee this day uh -huh. shall be in thine heart. Right. So that means the word is supposed to be in our mind. So a, a father, he's supposed to teach. He's supposed to instill the words of the Lord into his children's mind. Watch. Just go ahead and show it. Read on. And thou shalt teach them. So a father or a mother too, it says, thou shalt teach them the words of the Lord. And thou shalt teach them diligently uh -huh. until thy children. So us as fathers, we supposed to teach the Bible or the words of God diligently to our children. That's, that's right. Why? Because guess what? Zion Wade, that's not okay according to God. Right. Let's show it. I'm going to show it. So hold it. We're going to come at this. Let's get Romans. Watch this. Romans 1. We're going to Romans 1, what, 25. Romans 1, 25. Listen good. Because this is not okay. This is how we're going to show you. Watch this. The book of Romans, chapter 1 and verse 25. Who changed the truth of God into a lie. So what happened is the truth or the laws of the Bible have been changed into a lie. Right. Because now you got Bibles coming out. You got a Bible called the Gay Bible, where instead of Adam and Eve, it's Adam and Steve. Right. <laughs> That's crazy. Come on. Instead of Joseph and Mary, it's, I don't know, Jack and Jill or Jack and Jack. It's crazy. But come on, read on. Who changed the truth of God into a lie uh -huh. and worship the and worship and serve the creature more than the creator so that's what's going on what happened is his wife gabrielle union and also magic johnson wife they worship and serve the creature who is the creature the so-called white man. more than the creator we're talking about we're talking about fathers that's what we're talking about right now brothers here that just joined we're talking about fathers a father you're supposed to raise your children right like let's say you have you got a son you got a son and a daughter you too brother what's that but when you when you're raising your son do you want your son to stay a son or you don't want him to become a daughter go to the next verse go to the next verse but you want what you want your son we we reading it we, 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 we ain't done. We ain't done. Come on. So I said, would you want your son? Like you raise, let's say you're a father, you raising a son. I got a son too. I want my son to become a man like I'm a man. Right. I don't want my son to rise up. I raise him all his life and he turn into a woman. I don't want that. We don't. Who is blessed forever. Amen. For this cause, God gave them up. And to vile affections. So the Bible says, God gave them over to vile affections. Come on. For even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature. What's what's the natural use of a woman? What's the natural use to give birth, right? What's clean? What is right? Natural use of a woman. Like what? What? What does a woman come with naturally? A uterus. To give birth. That's what a woman got. Breasts. They got that. They're, they're general, different from us as men. But it said they a woman has changed the natural use into what? 
and change the natural use into that which is against nature. It's just against nature. So if a woman changes her use or decides she no longer wants the privilege that she was given by God and decides to change it to something else, that's unnatural. That's what right. it's saying. Right. That's against nature. That's what the Bible is saying. Come on. And likewise, also the men. And likewise, also the men. Going back to Magic Johnson's son, Zaya Wade, and many more. Come on. Leaving the natural use of the women burned in their lust, one toward another. So it said they burn in their lust. Meaning men were men, women were women. That's, that's what the Bible is saying. So these are things as fathers, brother here, brother here that look like Dwayne Wade. What's your name, by the way? Sorry. Darren. Sorry with a D2. I'm joking. So. I got you. But hey. You got some more people in there. Hey, okay. So we going over right now. We talking about fathers raising children. Because, well, the whole thing is we want our children to be raised in the Lord. Right. We don't want our children to end up being homosexuals. We don't want our children to end up being transsexuals or part of the LGBTQ community. We don't want that right. because we believe in the Bible. Right. So the Bible don't teach against the Bible teach against that. Right. So you can understand. Let's keep reading. And likewise, also the men, uh -huh. leaving the natural use of the women. So now the, the men have left the natural use of the woman, which was to copulate and to have children. Come on. Burn in their lust one toward another. Now, the confusion is so, so high. It, was, it got to the point where his son, Zaya, was with a woman that transitioned into being a man. Is. Still, is, right? Still is. What in the world? That's crazy. Wake him up. Why? You could have just did the same thing in, in the right order. Right. But they decided, you know what? I want to be a woman. And he's like, I want to be with you because you want to be a man. Right. <laughs> so it's like, that's just the confusion that's going on. That's crazy. Come on, read up. Men with men working that which is unseemly. That joint, it said that is unseemly. That's what the Bible says. That is unseemly. So us as fathers, us as mothers, you over there, auntie there, us as mothers, you, you're a mother, right? Sister here. Okay. Or you're aspiring to be one. Us as mothers, us as fathers, us as aspiring to be fathers. We raise in our children, we want them to, to be nurtured in the Lord. That's what we want. We don't want them to turn out like that. But it's straight, it's confusion here in this world. And there's a reason for it. Let me get Revelation. Okay, we can't read it. Keep staying there. Oh yeah, we say, oh yeah, let me stay in there then. Let's stay here. Keep going. This. And receiving in themselves that recompense of their error, which was meat. So it says they receive. So if you do these things, what the Bible is saying, you receive a reward for the works that you do. Bring it up. So what that means is if you change your nature uh, into something which is against God, you're going to get judgment from God. Right. What's some of the judgments? HIV. Right. Hey, what you say? Pornography. There's judgment for that. What they get? What's the what? Um, what's going on now? So it's gotten so bad that now they got something called MAP, which stands for um, men or NAMBLA. Let's do that one. The National Association of Man Boy Love. Wake them up. That's crazy. That's what they got. That's where it's going to now. Because this opened, because op, the, under the Obama administration, they made it a law that for um, homosexuals to get married. Once that, once that law was instituted, that opened up the floodgates. Now you got people talking about, I want, I'm ready, I want to be a pedophile. Let's make that a law. They say, I want to be a beast, yeah, let's make that a law. That's what's going on now. That's the confusion that's going on. And there's, read it again. Men with men working Minor that attractive. which is unseemly. Minor attract. That's what it means. Map. That's the new thing they got. M A P. It stands for minor attracted persons. That's the new joint they got. So first it started off with homosexuality, and now the floodgates are wide open. 
They're going to make laws to make it lawful to be a minor attracted person. That's going to be the next thing. So you're going to have to watch your kids. Remember that guy, Antoine Dotson, hide your kids, hide your wife. That's how it's going. It's going to literally be like that in the world. Bring you got to hide your kids, man. You got to hide them. Come on. And receiving in themselves that recompense of their error. So they're going to receive recompense. They're going to receive reward for that. Judgment. The, ju the, the judgment on in modern times is, like we said, sexually transmitted diseases. That's the judgment now. They get AIDS. They get all that stuff. Come on. Which was me. Which was me. It was good. Because y'all wanted to break the laws of God. This is what y'all get. And it's good for you. That's what the God is saying. Come on. And even as they did not like to retain God in their knowledge. So even as they did not like to retain God. So a lot of our people, they don't like to, they don't like to hear this, what the Bible is saying. Y'all hear, y'all being called right now by the God. Y'all hearing the words of God and this is cleansing your spirit. That's right. What is the nation? Nation is men leading by example. Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is children with role models.